what I like to call it is abstract reality. I love the feeling of the rigidness of the rules. There's many rules when I'm doing something realistic. Like this has, the eye has to be exactly the same proportions. The nose has to be really exactly the same kind of lighting. But I really love the feeling of when I've done that and then the big contrast of the freedom of the abstract. The abstract is kind of like no rules. I can start tattooing and I have a basic idea of where I want to go, but then from there on it's free. So for me, it has always been like real mind blowing. The jump from one to the other and putting th those two things together, abstract reality. I don't know the best name for it, uh, definitely. Avant-garde, now they were saying, uh, that's a cool name. Why? Because you can get many different ideas into the same image. If you have something that's half a face mixed with the background, and means, uh, mixed with something else. Uh, that just gives so much meaning. Uh, that's what clients are looking for. Especially what I like about all the splashes and all the stains in tattooing, they just feel like energy. Like when I see a stain, you can actually see the movement. You can see the stain falling and creating a splash and creating an effect, but all that is movement. It's not steel, it's like, an explosion capped in that moment. So that's for me what's so beautiful about an ink stain. It's like it's it's like stopping time for that explosion. It's just the moment when the, the ink hits the paper, it just gets stopped there. Like the movement stops and you can actually see how hard it hit it, how fast it did. It's just like energy, like watercolors, like one color mixing with other color. Yeah, that's, that's basically there. Uh, it's so much to play with. That that would be also the word, you know. It's so it feels so free. Um, when you put it beside something that's so rigid as as real a realism, it's just like I really. It's like the opposites put together, and that's what I really like about abstract reality, surrealism, and all these things.